All right, so what we have here are some different uh, cheap controllers I bought off of eBay. Uh, got all these pretty cheap off of eBay, and I'm, you know, tried to pair them to the Raspberry Pi and had some success and some failure. But we'll start with this one. This one here is, um, this was one of the cheapest ones. It was $8. I, it came with two. So it came in plastic. And um, it paired pretty nicely. It paired like a PlayStation 3 controller would. You just plug in the charge cable, wait 10 seconds, unplug the charge cable, press the home button, and then it, it, was, it paired pretty easily. Um, it's got some heft to it because it's got a little rumble pack in there, but... Uh, I'm not too crazy about these thumbsticks. They feel a little stiff, but I don't know. There's PS3 knockoff controller. Then we had this one, the uh, Strike NX Speedlink Strike NX Gamepad Wireless. And all right, it did come with a USB dongle. Now I couldn't pair it without using this dongle. So if you see this controller, you might be aware that you need the dongle to go with it because I'm not saying it can't be done, but I couldn't figure out how to pair it without using this dongle. Uh, this one, it's not super light. It's kind of light. Again, these thumbsticks, to me, they're just a little stiff or something. But other than that, it's, I don't know. It's not too bad. This one was like $12.89 on eBay. All right. Then I believe this one was right around $10. And again... This is a Power A PlayStation 3 controller. It's got some heft to it. Like it seems to uh, be kind of heavy. It, it's got some heft to it, but uh, I wasn't able to use it again without using this USB dongle. And this USB dongle is a little bulky. So if you got to plug something else in, yeah, it might be a problem, but these thumbsticks are actually a little better. This kind of pokes out pretty far, but I don't know. It's not too, too bad. All right. That one was 10, 10 something shipped. All right. Now this next one frustrated the living hell out of me. I was not able I did not have success with this. It came with some instructions in there, but I couldn't figure them out. They were the Mo Cute. This um, I was able to pair it to my phone somehow, with with barely trying. But trying to pair this thing to the Pi, I had no success. I tried and tried. I couldn't figure it out. I think it can be done because it, it popped up on the screen, you know, MoQ controller, and I even got it to say controller paired, and it still did not work after it said controller paired like three or four different times. Very frustrating. I'm glad this isn't the first one that uh, I started with because I would have been pretty frustrated. These thumbsticks are a little bit better, but this feels kind of cheap. It's, it's, it's light, and uh, it was pretty cheap. It was 11 something on eBay. All right. Then this one, I guess, was used. You know, my boxes were all came a little beat up, but this one is a GameSir G3. Now this one retails for about 30 bucks, but I got it on an eBay auction. I got it on an eBay auction for uh, 850 
free shipping. Came with a little charge cable. Came with a USB dongle. And, uh, it's, I did kind of like this one. It's, uh, the shape is a little off to me, putting, uh, but it's, overall, it's not bad, and it does light up nicely, lights up, and it's got a rumble pack in there, and, um, I was able to pair this without using this USB dongle, but the problem I encountered was when I wasn't using the dongle, if I turned the Raspberry Pi off and turned it back on, it would not remember this controller. It was like I never paired it, so I'd have to pair it again. So you might want to use the dongle with this one uh, to avoid that frustration because you know you don't want to have to pair it every time you start it. That was the GameSir G3, 850 on eBay. So you can find these controllers. You can find them cheap if you, if you, you know, search right on eBay. Now, this, I wasn't sure if it was going to be a knockoff or what to think. Now, if this is a knockoff, uh, I'm impressed. I, I wouldn't be able to tell. I'm going to hold on to it for a little bit. It seems, seems official to me. But uh, $13.99. You know, unopened $13.99. You could always use this with the Pi. The problem with the PlayStation 3 controller, though, is charging it. How do you charge it? Using your computer? Using a PlayStation 3? I had... I don't think I could charge it just plugging it into a wall with a regular USB cord. But, um... That is one option, though. A PlayStation 3 controller. You know, these are all wireless, and that was $13.99, Ship, free shipping. So all of these were under, what, $14? That was the most expensive one. Now, this is uh, kind of my favorite because the box is nice. I'm a sucker for nice packaging. Ooh. It's a heavy duty box here. And then it's got it's got the chargeable battery pack. So you can charge it. It's got the USB dongle, which I found I did not need, but you know, for faster sorry, uh you could pair it without using it. So let's just look at this nice box here, you know. Uh, I like the presentation like the presentation and then overall this has got some heft to it this on live controller they went out of business and I think some people might think these controllers are useless but it's got nice little thumbsticks that are I just I don't know I like this controller it's got some heft to it I do overall like it it's pretty seems like high quality got this for eleven dollars now these might be hard to find they're getting uh, more scarce I picked up a few of them for 11 bucks, um, I think I did pretty good because uh, it was able to pair with the Raspberry Pi and uh, didn't even need the dongle, but I have the dongle if I need it. It's got the rechargeable battery pack and it also has the AA battery pack, you know, so. Oh. Easy. Oh, there. It's in there. All right. So that was just a look at some third-party, some uh, different controllers, different wireless controllers I found on eBay for cheap. You know, you can find the deals. Just, uh, you know, keep searching. All right. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed.